Good morning, my delightful fangs! Welcome to the cavern. Since it's already March, I'm moving on to spring traditions. Since for many cultures, spring starts in the month of March. Today I'll be focusing on Osaro, but before we get into that, don't forget to show your support by clicking that like and subscribe button. Best thing is, it's free, but a huge help to my channel. Thank you so much to those that have already done so. It means a lot to me. You're amazing. So, what is Osara and who is Istra? Well, Osara is the spring fertility festival or holiday that honors Istra, the goddess of dawn. It's a time to plant seeds for whatever you want to grow throughout the year. Back in the day, farmers would grow vegetables and fruits for the coming fall, basically, when things would start dying. The symbolism surrounding Osara's fertility, rebirth, and renewal. There are other symbols, for instance, hares and rabbits. The March hare was viewed as a fertility symbol and a sign of spring because this particular species of rabbit is nocturnal most of the year, until March. It is the mating season for the animal, so during mating season, the March hares are seen all day long. What's interesting about this species of rabbit is that females can get pregnant with a second litter while pregnant with their first litter. It's amazing. <laughs> and probably why it's used for the symbol of fertility. It's not just rabbits, though, that are symbols of Osara. There are also colors, crystals, flowers, plants, and other animals. A few other animals that are symbolic of the holiday are lambs, birds, and chicks. Something you've probably seen with Easter, because that's pretty much the symbolism for Easter, too. And, of course, eggs. As with any celebration, feasting and merriment are part of the traditions surrounding Osara. It's also a time of ritual cleaning to sweep away old patterns and bring in renewal, hence spring cleaning. The origins of Osara come from Germanic and Celtic, uh, Celtic stories of the goddess Istra, but celebrating the spring equinox was not just in Northern Europe. In ancient Rome, they celebrated Sibyl, mother of the gods, and her consort, Attis. Indigenous Mayans honor the serpent deity, Kakalkan. Persians continue to celebrate the equinox as Nowruz, or the New Year. I'll be looking into where the Easter Bunny came from and other bunny stories like Peter Rabbit, and I think there's a few others that I've heard that were told to me when I was growing up next Friday. I'll talk, I'll talk about all that. I'm not sure what movie I'm reviewing as of this time, so it's going to be a surprise this evening. I just, I don't know if it's going to be a horror movie because I haven't seen anything that's new on Shudder or Amazon, HBO, Netflix, Hulu, any of those. I want to see Megan, but at the same time, I have a feeling it's going to be basically another Chucky. Sorry to those that love the movie. I just, I just don't have high hopes. I'm kind of a cynic when it comes to horror movies now, because lately every horror movie I've seen has been just terrible. There's been a few mixed in that were really good, but the vast majority lately have just been really bad. And... Unfortunately, it's making me want to stay away from the genre for a bit until enough movies come out that I can actually sit back and watch. I don't know, though. So, we'll see. I might talk about romance movies that I like because, well, that's kind of what spring is all about, I guess. <laughs> I guess you could say. But if you don't want to miss the upcoming content, click that bell icon to be the first notified about a new video. I will say Tuesday, I am still keeping with Gaming Tuesday. I'm going to try Tiny Tina's Wonderland if I can get it to work. I'm hoping I can get it to work. Uh, I'm not going to show the character customization portion, although I might because... I've heard many people have a hard time creating a feminine character, so I might break it into two parts. I might show the customization portion and then the gameplay. So if you're looking forward to that, click the little bell icon. 
Thank you so much for watching and sticking around to the end. Take care and have a lovely weekend. Bye, everyone.